A chance to move on here tonight is in store. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. I'm James Sabalski. Well, here we go. Game six tonight. Really looking forward to this one tonight. bodies to the front of the net James you want to create a screen and the goaltender drops into the butterfly position as a default and is battling to find the puck can't find it and beats him clean the Canucks have to be feeling good about this start here Cheryl yeah I know it's not rocket science James but you certainly play different when you have the lead than when you don't and when you're the away team and setting the tone that's a good start moves it quickly over to Trenton receives the pass can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Here's a feed in front. Oh, and they couldn't complete that. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. Right in front. And it banks off a stick in traffic. Here's a short pass to Sissons. An easy save by Demko. Trillin's got it in the corner. Delayed penalty looming. Bess has crossed the line and gained the zone. Look out, they can create some trouble here. Extra attack. He scores! Off the pipe and bolts in the twine. Well, it's a game of inches, isn't it? And this time, those inches, they work in his favor. They go right into the net. Two quick balls in a minute 30, James. Quick response back to back here, and the team is humming. Man, talk about putting your opponent on their heels. Lots of time left in this period. Vancouver's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. The Canucks take possession after that neutral zone faceoff. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Nashville's got possession of the puck. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Vancouver's got the puck in their own end. Lindholm's across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Moves it to Garland. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Nashville's got the puck. Shen's got it in the defensive end. And that's stolen by Lindholm. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. Novak's got it in the offensive zone. Vancouver's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Sends it over to Sidora. And they turn it over in the neutral zone. Nashville's been disrupting play all night long, and this is because of their stiff position. You have to find ways to be a real multiple goal deficit but they pushed they had good habits and they find themselves within one battle along the boards knocks the puck loose after a solid hit nashville's got it in their own zone and that's knocked away in the defensive end by carrier 
Moves the puck up to Forsberg. The Canucks gain possession. Quick pass to Pedersen. Still keeps a hold of it. Vancouver's crossed the line and on the attack. And that plays offside. We got a faceoff coming up. Forsberg's been feeling it, James. You know who else is doing it? His teammates. They have been the beneficiaries of a great leader on the ice who's just been distributing the puck and generating a ton of offense. Quick feed to Sidora. Moves it up through the middle for the right. And that's knocked away. Vancouver's got the puck. The Canucks going to work on offense. Puck exits the zone. Yulson's taking it from his own end. The Predators have it against the wall. Scores! It's in the back of the net. And it comes from an unlikely source because that's his first career playoff goal. Well, he's been relentless, James, in this playoffs. And you know what? He's found a way to find the back of the net. That's going to be a huge confidence boost for himself and his teammates. A couple goals in a minute. 50, James. Incredible. And look at this. We've got a brand new game now. Well, a comfortable lead. It goes by the wayside. Giddy up. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. And there's a little boost from off the wing as the centers were tied up there. Sherwood's going to cut it against the half wall. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. Trying to nifty move when you have good hands. Sometimes it works, sometimes you get denied. And that's what happened there. Nashville's got it across the line. Oh, the thievery coming up with the puck on the play. McKay is moving the puck through his own zone. Handles the pass. Moves it quickly over to Sagan. And that was a good heads up read to make that save. In all alone! Oh, goal save on the play! And you gotta love these one on one battles. In particular, the goaltender is so impressive, tracks the puck and makes the save. And he loses control of the puck. He got all of that hit. Vancouver's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. Dumps the puck in. Grabbed along the boards by Fabro. Here they come, down the right side and on the attack. Moves it to the middle. And it's blocked. Demko's got the puck and he's going to hang on. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. The Predators will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Here's a short pass to Suter. Vancouver's got it along the wall. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. Slides it diagonally to O'Reilly. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. He makes a great read on that puck, James. I mean, the quick release wrist shot, that's a tough one to stop. All the shooter wants to do is get you off guard, get it in behind you, but he gets square to it. Moves it to Heronic. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Great hits up play with the stick by Shen. Now a quick pass to Heronic. That eyes on the play. Rebound control is critical in the game of hockey. Oh, that's it. from the middle. The Canucks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Ahead of steam now towards the front and uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Vancouver's got a hold of it against the wall. Tremendous stop by Demko. And he takes the feed. Hughes looks around. Shot! And that ricochets off a twig in front. And he takes the dish. And now it's grabbed by Carrier. Quick pass to Smith. Fantastic save! Puck grab by Lafferty. Gaining momentum along the boards. Here's a shot! Oh, a clutch save! A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender in task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. The Canucks gain possession along the wall. From center they 
get into the attacking area. Wafts it out of midair to keep control. The Predators have it now. Across the line and on the attack. Dumps it in. And he can't hang on after that hit. A quick save. The Canucks gain control of the puck. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Quick feed to Sissons. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. And that goes off a of body. Trips it on net. And he takes the feed. And now he passes up to Trudin. Denied by the goaltender. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. And they finally get it out and finally stop all that pressure. Saros freezes the puck and opts for the whistle. Saros' mobility is what helps him shut down those cross-crease chances so well, guys. His post-to-post zone ability is that movement to stay with the play and make the stop. Scoops up the puck. Moves it quickly over to Cole. Here's a chance. Fires the wrist shot. And it's off the air. The Canucks looking to break the tie here, and they bring another one off the post. So frustrating, James. Rocks it on the play. Made that stop. But puts it off the inside of the frame. Offensive opportunities, and they don't happen all the time, especially in a tie game, and an opportunity to cash in right there, and it just goes off the pipe and out. Let's get the call. Now this is such an obvious call for the official and discipline. Once the arms extend, you're going to get the cross-checking call. The Predators get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. First power play opportunity for this team. It's going to start in the face-off circle, getting possession with the win, and then looking to set up. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. And they clear the zone, and that'll shed some time off. A great sequence by the PK unit. Really aggressive, close quickly on the puck, and they get it down the ice. Vancouver's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Can't keep a hold of it. Great four check by Sherwood. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Centering feed. He scores! What a goal! When it's a tie game, all you want to do when you're on the PK is make sure it remains that way. And it's an effective kill, but it winds up going north. They break the tie. They get the shorthanded goal. That's an effective PK. The Canucks have gone up by one here in the opening frame. How does this now change the complexion of this one? Well, I think it's really important because they got momentum right now. More jump to their step, and now they'll want to try and stay aggressive and increase that lead. Take the momentum and use it to their advantage. The boards they battle for the puck back and forth. Let's see what the officials are calling. Well, it's tough timing to take a penalty at the end of a period. You want to make sure that you can reset and regroup, but first things first, you got to kill the penalty. Puck set to drop. We've got some four on four coming up. Well, four on four is similar to three on three. There's more ice available, and you can't just dump it in. You want to possess the puck and try and create numbers around the ice. That's two on ones all over. The Predators moving ahead. Handles the puck. Big save. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high danger scoring chances eventually go in. Picked off by Friedman. Shot and just got a piece of it to keep it out. Scooped up along the wall by Sissons. Pumps the puck away. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Let's see the call here. A tight game at the end of a period, and you take a penalty. Your PKers have to come up huge and get you to the intermission. As we get set for the face-off, a chance to see both teams in a little four-on-four -four action here. And they win the draw on their own end. Feeds it on over to Hughes. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. 
Twittering feed! Couldn't complete the pass! Nashville's got it against the boards. Picked off in front. There's the horn. Still 40 more minutes left in regulation time. We'll get to the second period right after this. Fans, take a look at our scoreboard as we acknowledge tonight's special groups in attendance. Opening face-off for period number two. About set to go. Here we go. Middle frame now underway as the puck drops. All right, Pounder, how would you assess this game through the first 20 minutes played? demko has been fantastic in the game so far, James. I mean, he's the only reason his team is still in it. Great heads-up play in the neutral zone by Novak. And that's off a stick. Gets a stick on it. Gives them nothing in front. Sometimes goaltenders just make it look easy, James. And look at how big he makes himself in the net as he's trying to track and find the puck at all costs. It almost looks easy for him, but that's an impressive save. Bluger's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Puck scooped up by Yossi. We got a stoppage as the puck sails over the glass. Sissons will look to win possession here on the faceoff and try to continue this power play on the right note. The Canucks come up with the defensive zone draw. Keeps possession on the play. And they move the puck out of harm's way. From the left side, takes it at center. There's a stop with the blocker by Demko. Demko's got the puck and will hang on for the whistle. Well, he hasn't been busy, James, but he makes a key save right there. Really important that he keeps his head and focus in the game. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Canucks have a little breathing room here, but not much as they lead it 3-2. Moves the puck along the half wall. Back. Stretches one out to Mikheyev. Can't get a hold of that pass. Bess has got it along the wing. Here's a shot. Here's a shot. And he stakes that one with the club. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. And they win the offensive zone face-off. Now let's see if they can capitalize. Saros makes the save and hangs on for a stoppage of play. And they take possession after the defensive zone face-off. Pass across to Trennan. He carries the puck up along the wing. The Predators play it along the wing. Still using a stick to poke the puck away. Here's a short pass to Miller. Vancouver's got it in the offensive zone. Quick shot! That's on a stick. Moves it to Buster. He scores! And it's back-to-back -back tallies! Yeah, and they've been chomping at the bit. Now they've got their opponent on their heel. They need a quick change here and find a way to continue the momentum. Well, this is a really smart shot through traffic, James. The recognition of the net front presence in screen, and the goalie drops to the butterfly position, really tries to make himself as big as possible, hoping that the puck just hits him because he can't see it. Vancouver's now taking a two-goal lead here in the second. Well, that's a huge goal. That's going to give him a two-goal cushion. You can see the excitement on the bench right now. That's all it takes to have an impact. They put it in the net. Now they can take a deep breath and go play with creativity. Quick pass to McDonough. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck now. Taken along the wall by Suter. Quick feed to Hughes. And now he moves it quickly to Suter. Moves the puck over to Heronic. Knocked away by McDonough. Nashville's got possession of the puck. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Sherwood. Looks to set up at the point now. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Here's a short pass to Holtlander. Break away! Goaltender gets to the top of the 
which makes himself look huge and is extremely aggressive to be able to make that stop. Pumped off the puck. Slides it quickly to Hughes. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Nashville's looking to break out. Puck picked up by Forsberg. Drives it in his own end. Takes a shot. And it's saved by Demko. He's able to make a clean save on that wrister, James. A quick release shot, and he's square to it. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Evangelista. Moves around along the half wall. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. Moves it to DiGiuseppe. From the right side and up the middle. Taken by Yossi. Intercepted at center by DiGiuseppe. And now he passes it to Evangelista. Novak's gaining momentum. With possession along the wall. Good hit to knock the puck loose. And now it's grabbed by Novak. Great stop by Demko. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Fires it. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Saros. Still lots of time left here in this frame. 4-2 is the score. And they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Great incredible reflexes on the one saved by Saros. Center's gliding up to the face-off dots here. Sissons takes possession right off the draw. Tosses it on to Trenton. Quick pass to Suter. Poked away at center by Yossi. And a good heads-up defensive play in the open ice. And it's a quick pass to Favro. Takes the pass. Big time stop. Demko's able to deny that scoring chance right from the slot area, James. That's a beautiful one. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. And that's blocked away. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps him at bay. This is an impressive save right here, James. I mean, there's a ton of net front presence, and so a lot of traffic that he has to battle through to find the puck, and he does, and he makes a nice save. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. And he was locked in on that save as play continues. As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's exactly what he does right there and just takes away the net. And that's just out of reach. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Miller. Picked up along the wall by Shen. Takes the feed. They've got numbers here. Oh, what a save of the goal! Demko's been really sharp tonight, James, and just have a look at his save percentage, and he's making the stops that he needs to. But man, his team's played well. They got going north, they created opportunities, and the reason why they have a healthy lead. He was locked in there. They are really pouring on the pressure here. And they go the other way as they clear the zone. Quick feed to Lozon. And he slides it quickly to O'Reilly. Nashville's got the puck against the boards. The Canucks have it now. Moves it quickly over to Lindholm. Takes the bump and loses control of the puck. And the puck clears the zone. They'll be forced to leave as well. Zadorov's got the puck. Here's a chance with the stop. Here's a short pass to Nyquist. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. Oh, I know what he was trying to do there, James. He thought he had it with that move, but he created some space for himself, but unfortunately loses the handle and it dies on his stick. And he slides it quickly to Lozon. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Lindholm's got the puck in his own zone. Grabbed along the board by Wilson. Vancouver's on the attack. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Vancouver's got a hold of it along the wall. Knocked away with the stick by Jankowski. The Predators move the puck in the defensive zone. Moves it to Pedersen. There he is from the slot! 
Offensive zone possession time. And how about the goaltender? Seeing so much rubber tonight and a lot in the netting. On the attack, they come down the right wing. From right out of midair, he bats it down. Charles Rods his opponent after that last save. And you can just see the shooter is in disbelief. He can't believe he came up with that one. But what it does is it sends a message to his team to start playing. Start playing in front of him, and they need to answer the call. Yossi's the leader of this team. And who do you look to when you're down? You find a way to look to your leaders. They create momentum. Everyone jumps on board. This game is not out of reach yet. Quick pass to Glass. And now he angles it across to Sissons. Takes a shot. Scores! Break out the clutch here on the ski lift because that's four unanswered. Well, it's incredible. You can tell that they are moving and shaking. They're getting the puck going north. They're transitioning so fast. And man, do they have their opponent on their heels. It always amazes me, James, to see how quickly these shooters can get the puck off of their stick. I mean, they can shoot off their inside leg, their outside leg. It doesn't matter. But what does matter? The positioning from that slot area. You know that if you get all of it, you're going to tag one home. Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. Vancouver's got possession of the puck after that neutral zone faceoff. Play continues. I've never been a goaltender except in road hockey, James. But I tell you, if you take one off the mask, you got to be rattling. But nonetheless, he finds a way to get the save. And that's what you got to do. Put everything in front of it if you want to make the stop. Now a quick pass to McDonough. Nice zone entry on the left side. Sends the pass over. The Canucks are across the line and into the offensive end. Quick feed to McKay. And he had the answer on that play. Sends a pass over. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. And we'll get a reset after the puck goes up and out of play. The Canucks have spent the majority of tonight in the offensive zone, and they continue to lead big time here late in the second. Nashville's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Moves it quickly over to O'Reilly. From the slot, fires away. Puck is frozen and will get a face off. covers it up and both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume good job tangling up his opponent here the Canucks get a hold of the puck in the open ice back to the blue line only oh, just not enough of that to keep it out scooped up along the wall by Yossi Nashville's got it in their own zone working the puck deep inside their own end Oh, 
Oh, this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it, you got to be fast, you got to be quick and show those reflexes. He does that and makes the save. The Canucks win the defensive zone faceoff. Well, there's the horn, and that means two periods down. And there's still a critical third to play. Looking forward to this one. Third period action is coming up. Fans, a portion of tonight's proceeds will fund a children's playroom at City Hospital, providing a safe, fun environment for kids visiting long-term care patients. If you'd like to learn more or to donate, please visit our team website. And they are ready to drop the puck on period number three. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Well, Pounder, we've played more than 40 minutes now in this one. How do you view things? Vancouver's been consistent through 40 minutes of play here, James, and they have a comfortable lead. Now it's about bringing it home, and in order to do that, you got to make sure that you're defensively responsible. Some last-second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers are tied up. And that goes off course off a of body. Quick feed to Suter. Moves it to Forsberg. Gaining momentum up along the side. Grabs the puck. Beautiful read of the defensive end by Pedersen. And a smart heads up play to put that away by O'Reilly. Quick pass to Holtlander. Nashville's got it in their own zone. There's a shot to Eisen in close. Well, that wrister had some heat, James, but he was able to get in front of it and turn it aside. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Gaining speed to Sand. Here they come on the attack. The Canucks are in transition. Textbook poke check by Besser. Angles it over to Sissons. Jostled off the puck. Taken along the wall by Yossi. They score! If they ever needed one, this was exactly the time. Well, they're just trying to get some momentum back in this game. So deflating when you give up so many goals, James. But you got to figure that this is a step in the right direction. But what can they do with it now? They got to build or it's over. The Predators are starting to show a little respectability here amongst themselves as they get one back. Yeah, it's about mojo. It's how you end the game with good habits because you want to make sure that you don't carry the beginning of the game into your next one. Great reach with the poke check by Cole. Picked up along the boards by Garland. And now he moves it quickly to Cole. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Takes the feed. The Canucks going to work on offense. Here's a chance. Slot the side on the blocker. The Predators take it along the wall. Trent's got it in the offensive zone. Scrum along the boards. And it's a quick pass to Carrier. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Loving the puck. And some good footwork to kick it away. Quick feed to Novak. Picks off the feed. And now he moves change it to Darling. Nashville's got the puck. Lozon stick handling in his own zone. Moves the puck. Vancouver's looking to break out of their own end. Shot! And puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. Sometimes there's pressure on players when they get into that prime time scoring area. And because of it, they rush the shot. And I think that happened right there. Stop by the goaltender. Across the line.
line from center. Here's a shot. Scores! Rips it off the pipe and into the net. Wow! You almost needed a double take there, James. When you hear that sound, sometimes you think it's out, but this one goes in. We see players working from this area all the time in practice. A quick snapshot. Goalie can't get set to position in time, and it winds up in the back of the net. The Canucks continue to attack the net here in period number three, adding yet another goal to their score. Well, it's been all areas of the game that have really been terrific tonight, James. I've also enjoyed the communication that we're seeing on the ice, not just the body language, but also the vocalness. I mean, they're creating all over the ice. You can move up on the watch. Here he is, shot inside. And a great read to turn that play aside. Just a great defensive read there. Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from and he makes the save. Handles the saucer pass beautifully. Oh, that's a piece of it with the glove! They gain the zone from the left side. Here's a shot! And there's a glove save on the play. Teams are lined up and we are ready to take this draw. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. Moves it quickly over to Suter. And he keeps possession. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. Vancouver's won the draw in the neutral zone. Handles the puck at the point. Here's the pass down low. Can't connect on the shot. Knight was swooping in on the attack. Scores! They'll get those rally caps on. Now everyone's going to need to have one on. It's going to be a team collective contribution if they want to get back in this one. But it all starts with one goal. If they can layer it, find a way to get another one quickly, you never know. Certainly down, but not out completely yet. Nashville's recognized that they're not going to play run time here, so at least try to make it respectable. Respectable, and they can finish with physicality, and that's something that the staff will be telling them. Also look for everyone to be jumping into the attack, trying to get some pressure on their opponent and get some much-needed goals. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. The Canucks get a hold of it. Here's a short pass to Hughes. Vancouver's crossed the line and on the attack. And that's intercepted by O'Reilly. Gets the puck in deep. Vancouver's got the puck along the boards. Taken by Di Giuseppe. Vancouver's got the puck in the defensive end. The Canucks carry it along the wall. Big time save! Oh my goodness! Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive win. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Canucks win the draw and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Pucks it away to keep the pressure on. And just a bit outside. The Predators will play it from the defensive zone. Trenet's got it along the wing. The Canucks take possession in the defensive end. Delayed penalty coming up here. in these games. He just came out flat and nothing you did made it better. Now they got to kill off a penalty when they're getting blown out. Real tough game. The Canucks send their man advantage unit out once more. They haven't scored yet in the game on the power play, but no need to get frustrated. They all bring a different skill set. It's the reason why they're out there. Centering key! And that goes off a stick! Oh, and that goes wide as he went off a body. Well, James, he had good time and ability to get his stick on it. Changes the direction. Almost fools the goalie, but misses the net. 
Slides it up to Smith. Whacks it into the offensive zone. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck. And he takes the pass. Great defensive effort with the stick. Picked up along the wall by Besser. And that's a smart heads-up play by McDonough. Puck dumped into the forward go for a change. Hironik's got it in the defensive end. Shot! Oh, and that one pops up short as he just gets another good one! And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. O'Reilly's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Blast is now standing ready to get back on the ice. Being on the power play is a privilege. Trust me, I know I was never on it, always on the PK. So for those players who didn't execute, yes, they had a comfortable lead, and some would say it's not a big deal, but to each and every one of them, it should be. Pass back to the point. Puck scooped up by Suter. The Canucks have it now. Slides the puck over. Wants to pass it to Glass. And that's stolen, and they'll go on the attack. Feeds it over to Sissons. Nashville's got the puck along the wall. Takes it up, but he's still got the puck. Came up with the save on that play. Good awesome again! You can certainly tell that the goaltender is dialed in on that last sequence of saves, James. He's to position, so he finds a way to make multiple saves back-to-back. To the front! Puck picked up by Garland. The Predators take over on possession. Slick feed. Done awesome! Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Vancouver's in on the offensive attack now. And he slides it quickly to McKay. Takes the feed at the back end. Big save in front. Reaction time is so critical for goaltenders because with the way the players shoot in this game today, man, it is so tough to stop. So this one, instincts. Glove goes up, makes the save. Officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. Nashville's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Moves it to Fabro. I really like the effort on this goal, James. He shows a knack for the net and being real hard and heavy on his stick as he's able to put that rebound in the net. Goaltender's got to clean that up, though. That one got kicked right back out. Nashville's clearly sending a message that they're not going to roll over in this one. With a two-goal deficit, they have to have desperation and urgency. They'll need two players on the puck at all times. Retrieval to possess the puck is necessary. Quick pass to Forsberg. Offensive zone. And off the draw, they win possession. Shins moving the puck through his own zone. Moves into the slot. Shuts it down with the paddle. What a stop. Nashville's been leading in the shot department most of the night, but they continue to trail here late in the third. Here's a shot! Nice pad save! Oh, and it's another save on the play! And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. And the play is whistled dead, but here's the call. Jankowski's called for tripping. He's off to the box.
get that puck moving. These players know exactly what they're doing. They work on it in practice. Spoke to some of them earlier today at the pregame. And they talked about the execution and the precision in particular with their puck movement. With the one-timer. Turn that chance aside. Tremendous intensity here. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck now. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Quick feed to the Scores! And they capitalize with the extra player on the ice, and it's a power play goal. While using the advantage of having extra ice available to them, James, that's why their most skilled players are on the ice. That one's executed to perfection. Vancouver's been running away with this one since the beginning of the game, and no signs of slowing down in the third. It's been a productive night, and this is one of those games that gives everyone confidence, and this is important for your lineup as everyone gets it as they feel like they're contributing. Under a minute to go here in regulation time. Stopped by the goaltender. Here's a blast! Oh, the shot dies in the traffic jam. And now it's grabbed by Suter. Vancouver's looking to break out. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Vancouver's top line looks like they're having a ton of fun out there, James. They're showing their chemistry and their reason why they're in the lead in this game. Hooked to right by Zidorov. They came, they saw, they conquered. They're moving on to the next round. And there it is, the final hole. And a hush falls on the stadium as they celebrate on the ice. Physical, timely goals. They checked all the boxes in this series here, Cheryl. They really did, and harder to do when you're playing away in someone else's barn where they have the crowd to their advantage, and they were able to silence them, James, because they managed the temperature of the game. You didn't get too high, didn't get too low, stuck with their structure, trusted the process, and got it done. And got this crowd out of it. Thanks so much for joining us here. It was a fun one to call, and we will see you soon. For all of us here at EA Sports, stay safe.